the anxiety and fear. It had been something that um, I've struggled kind of my entire adult life and was just kind of normal. At the beginning of the corporate fast that we did in January, the first thing that came to mind that I felt like the Lord really wanted to deal with and bring um, freedom to was anxiety and fear. As the fast began and we cut out media and I was doing some food fasting, um, I felt like rather than dissipate anxiety, you know, was able to rise up even more. There was less things distracting me from it. There was one particular day within the first week, I think, where it was just especially bad and my husband was home, so I just called him and I, I was like, we need to sit down and pray about this right now. It's just, I couldn't get a hold of my thoughts. We sat down and, you know, just invited the Holy Spirit to come and it was probably a half an hour span of time and I just, the Holy Spirit came so clearly. He showed us how to pray. He kind of walked us through, you know, what to, what to pray, what to renounce. In the midst of our prayer time, I think the most significant part for me was, um, I saw a picture of, of a hand reaching down inside of me and pulling up this um, dark black sledge. And um, felt like the Lord was just like, Aaron, like this is uncaptured thought life. When you thought an anxious thought and you did not deal with it, you didn't pray about it, you didn't consider it, you didn't lay it before me, you just let that sink into you. This is what it's done. I just saw the Holy Spirit, like I'm, I'm taking this out of you, God. like I'm removing this from you. As the prayer time kind of wrapped up, I felt, it felt good. I, we felt like something had happened, but it was kind of the coming days and weeks that I really saw the fruit of it. It doesn't have the power it did before and I can take in truth and it displaces that those anxious thoughts and removes them and that truth is what stays. I feel like God freed me from the power of anxiety and I'm just dealing with the residual like habits, the leftover habits of how I had been living for a very long time. In my childhood, I wasn't an anxious, fearful, like um, a worried kid and so I feel like he's restoring me to that place of childlikeness and freedom that I had before and so I just really see him as just a restorer.